Welcome to another episode of Quick Tech Tips and Reviews. My name is Tony and with this channel I try to bring you guys a variety of different tech related tips and content. If this is your first time with us, please consider subscribing to the channel and hit that little bell so that you're alerted to when I release new content. In today's video we're going to take a look at how to add multiple WAN IP addresses to an edge router. Okay guys, I'm going to show you quickly how easy it is to add multiple public IP addresses to an edge router's WAN port. I'm signed into my lab edge router. It's an edge router X SFP. You can see here on ETH0, I have a static IP of 192.168.25.225. Now I'm simulating the internet. This WAN port is plugged into just another switch on my main network. Here you can see down on switch zero, my LAN is on 192.168.1.1. Now for the purposes of this video, let's just imagine that you have a need for multiple IP addresses and your ISP was able to give you, let's say a block of five. Now, why would you want to do this? Well, you might want to take one of your internal devices and just map it to use one of those specific public IP addresses. Maybe I'll do a video on that. We'll talk about SourceNet in another video. But again, for the purposes of this simple, quick video, let me just show you how easy it is. So let's just imagine you see we have dot 225. Let's say our IP gave us dot 225 through dot 229. Here's how simple it is. Let's start by going over to the actions tab of ETH0. Let's click on the drop down and click on config. Once we have this dialog box open, here's our first static IP address. Let's click on add IP. And we're going to say from the drop down, we're going to say manually define address. And we're going to make this one 226 slash 24. We're going to add another one. We're going to say manually define address. We're going to make this 227 slash 24. And let's add one more out of the five. We're going to say manually define IP address. And we'll make this one 228 slash 24. So what do we have? One, two, three, four, five. All right, let's do the fifth one. Let's say manually add address again from the drop down. And we're going to make this one 229 slash 24. And we'll go ahead and say save. And now you can see here on ETH0, now we have a block of WAN IP addresses from 225 all the way up to 229. If you found any value in today's video, please give it a thumbs up. Be sure to check out some of my other videos listed up above. Remember to subscribe, like, and share. And please use those Amazon affiliate links. I know they don't change your price, but they do help out the channel. My name is Tony with Quick Tech Solutions. As always, I thank you for watching. See you next time.